It's the oldest building still standing in downtown Sauk Rapids, and it is in the process of getting a major renovation. Jeremy Anderson of Sauk Rapids bought the former Sauk Rapids Herald building back in August of 2015. His first project was to completely gut and renovate the two upstairs apartments, which hadn't been used as apartments since 1990. Now, the restored two-bedroom and one-bedroom apartments both have new tenants. Anderson says he's now moved on to the lower level. Yeah, the lower level's just one big room right now, and I'm trying to get it um, finished up to like a vanilla space to lease out. Okay. Uh, right now we're trying to work on the, get the exterior finished up now. Anderson says he and a co-worker have been doing all the work themselves, and they're mostly working on it during the winter months. He says restoring the old brick building is labor-intensive. Well, all the brickwork on the outside have to be repointed. So every joint has to be ground out and then repointed in. Uh, the whole front of the building, we had to completely take the brick down because they were all loose and ready to fall. So we're in the process right now of laying them brick up, and when that gets done, we will be getting a brand new storefront and a side entrance. He's hoping to have the lower level finished and ready to lease out by later this year. And as for a future tenant for that space, Anderson says it could be anything from a retail store to an office to maybe a new bar and restaurant. The Benton County Historical Society says the building was built in 1912, which is three years before the old Capitol Tavern and church buildings were built. The Sauk Rapids Sentinel and the Herald newspapers had been in that building since 1938. Jim Maurice, WJON.